What's up, guys? Erroneous here, back with another Raid Shadow Legends video. Going to be running into Live Arena. We do have about 30 minutes remaining in the Live Arena. So, first, I want to show you something cool. I did get an upgrade to my Samsung 3 Star Awakening, which just popped up a little bit ago during the reset. So, that's pretty cool. And then I could get an Eryx one, but I don't have enough Essence. Now, I could farm the Iron Twins and potentially get enough Essence and get an Eric Soul, which would be helpful on my account. But I think I might just skip it for now. I'm not really 100% sure yet. So, all right, let's go into Live Arena. Oh, let me show you the upgrade. Let me show you the guy. Let me show you Samson, the Masher, my boy. So I've upgraded his chest plate. Of course, I showed you that already. Uh, still focusing on upgrading the weapon, the helmet, and the shield as well. I need to re-roll this into HP, hopefully. And then I need to work on Shogun's Grove eventually. And we'll upgrade the amulet, which have a double HP percent. And we'll upgrade this as well. The banner is actually not bad. And I don't believe I have a triple HP six star. Let's see. Let's go with equipped. Let's go with priority stats with HP being the highest. Yeah. Very, 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 very minimum. And it's 18% plus 4%. This one's 17% plus 4%. I'm not going to make that switch. That's my best one. It's a rare. Wow. But obviously in the future, I'll get better gear. I just don't seem to get any rings that are good. All right. So did you see his total stats? I don't know if I showed you that. All right. So total stats right now, 111,000 HP, 3,500 defense now because of the 600 additional defense from the blessing upgrade. 227 speed, 256 crit damage, 137 accuracy. Again, he does place increased accuracy on himself with this ability for three turns. But with Polymorph being so prevalent still in the game, he can Polymorph himself. So that's a bit of a, a gamble there. So I try to have his accuracy as low as possible. Now, you can put him in accuracy and try to get stuns more often. But personally, I like the damage. So... Yeah, that's a lot of HP. This is a baseline with a three star. I don't have a plus one. That would be pretty insane if I did. In terms of the skinwalkers, I just have HP here. And then we have to get a lot more duplicates to go. And he'll get more defense, more speed in the future. So he could end up being absolutely ridiculous in the future. And then I'm going to upgrade his gear even further during the next Dark Fae rotation, I hope, if I can get some good pieces of gear. All right, let's do this. Let's run into here. We're at 3309. We left off with two wins yesterday, a loss. All right, let's do this. Here we go. Here we go. Mr. Warrior, starting off strong. Sifi or Wukong. Oh, Arbiter. Okay, okay. Uh, Should I take the Wukong from him? Yeah, let's do that. Let's take the Wukong. Now that my essence supply is literally gone. Ended up getting that six star basher the other day. Oh my god, that's filthy. Crixia has to be banned. That is filthy. Six star Mikage. Whew. Wow. But anyways, I was saying, now that I have all my essence gone in the market, you know, you gotta work on upgrading more again and, and farming more iron twins. All right, so in terms of who I want to pick, I mean, I'm definitely going to go Samson. I think I need cleansers. Makage is a problem, too, because she does increase accuracy, and she can strip, like, everybody. Oof. And she can stun. I mean, he's probably not going to pick Samson. That's, that's a given. I think we go with maybe Elva. Yeah, let's go with Elva. And let's go with Samson. This is going to be a tough fight. Maybe I do UDK last if he has like a Rotos. But he's going to have ally attack as well. Oof. That's crazy. All right, this isn't good. Maybe I can go with out, not, I guess, counterattacks. Let's ban here, Crixia. I don't know if I survive this. It's the Leo that's going to kill me. And then the, the stuns as well. All he has to do is block the Elva. He blocked my Skull Crown. I'm surprised. 
I'm actually very surprised at that. I do have the Cruelty Blessing now on my Samson instead. And at level 3, I think it can decrease defense up to 20%. So that's kind of cool. I don't know, though. This is probably going to be a loss. He's going to stun or try to strip right now. Hopefully, they get a 50-50, don't strip. And of course, I always, always, always don't end up getting lucky. We're dead. Yikes. Yeah, we're dead here. GG's. Sammy survived, but then took the Soul Reap. Dang, that guy has an insane team. So, I gotta make sure I take Makage away. Take Makage. Take Speed. I probably should have just put in my Tormund, to be honest. But, it is what it is. Now that I think about it. Although, he would have just banned Tormund anyways, right? So it wouldn't have mattered. Alright, let's see what this guy's got going on. I just started doing the champion tags recently. I know somebody put that in my comments. I, I know I do have to start doing that, though. But I started putting champion tags on people, but it's not complete yet, so I have to keep working on that. Uh, He's going to bring in Rodos, though. Could be a problem. I guess I'll go with Speed. Or I could just go with Duchess now, so he doesn't take Duchess. That'll be a problem if he takes Duchess as well. He's definitely going Rodos, though. Or he's going to go Leo or something else now that I have UDK. But there are some people who still put in the Rodos regardless of if I put in UDK and they just ban UDK. So we'll see what he does. I'm surprised, though. Ah, that last battle. That stinks. Just couldn't survive with the speed that he had. Warlord Lockout, and he's taking Foley. Interesting pick. Um, I could probably just do this. Go speed. Yeah, I'll go speed. I could take out his Warlord. Or I could take out a Seafy, potentially. He could go with Tormund, though. Let's do this instead. Let's do Makage. Just to reduce the fact that he might put in Tormund. I'll go with my Samson anyways. I know he's going to be weak against Foley, but I feel like we might be fine. Foley's really a glass cannon, so that's his downfall. And hopefully I can just do a double smack, kill somebody. Okay, he's got him more to Macabre. That's a problem too. I mean, he's just going to ban my, my Kage, right? I could throw in Ragash. Actually, no, not even Ragash. I could just throw in him instead. Errol. I'm going to ban... Well, if he bans Makage, I think I'm just going to ban this just in case. He did ban the... Damn it. Ah, I should have just banned a Sifi. I was thinking that he was going to ban my Makage, but... Then he would have been faster with his Warlord. Dang. Yeah, this is a GG's. He's going to end up killing me with Foley. Unless we can survive fully smack, I mean, maybe we get lucky. Oh, we're faster than him. That's wild. Let's take out the CP now. And then he'll revive. Let's go like this with the protection. And we'll take out the Foley. One smack. 110k. And I'm not going to double hit. I'm just going to go right here. We actually might win this potentially, but she's going to revive. He could kill my Errol because he's kind of... He actually didn't. That's not what we want. He got the Fiery Passage already. He revives. But I take a turn first. I'm, I'm going to risk it here and go with the A1. We took him out. Perfect. <clears throat> Risk it for the biscuit here. Try to strip. We didn't get it. See, every time I try to strip, never happens. Every time the enemy tries to strip, 
happens every time. Ridiculous. Uh, we're gonna go with the double hit. She still survived, which is ridiculous. I, I don't have books in my Errol. That's the problem. I have zero books in my Errol. You know, he's gonna kill us. If he takes him out. It's fine, I guess. Damn, man. Let's decrease her speed so we can take a turn and hopefully take him out right here with my boy Samson. Ah, weak hits, weak hits, weak hits, weak hits. Okay, revives again. And let's go ahead and try to stun. There's a stun. Perfect. Take her out again. Oh, you son of a biscuit, dude. She's got big, big defense going on. Oh, he's going to kill me. Oh, I got so lucky. I just got so lucky. Go like this. Let's uh let's take her out. Dang, weak hits everywhere. Weak hits galore. Elva's so tough against me because of the weak hits. And she'll keep on veiling now, which is annoying. She'll keep on just sleeping. Okay, he slept in this time. Let's go, AoE. Dang it, dude. Not doing enough damage. How is he taking so much damage mitigation? I don't think he has damage mitigation built in. Okay, we took him out, even though he's positive affinity against me. Alright, let's switch back. Go ahead and switch forms and try to see if we can turn back the turn meter here. Not enough. That sucks. Increase accuracy. Let's go ahead and take out Foley again. We just gotta keep on taking out Foley, I feel like. He might be able to revive Foley again. Nope. Not quite. Let's go ahead and remove that. We got the weakens out there, though. That's huge. Does she take a turn before me? No, I don't think so. Ah, he had it ready. I almost had him, dude. Okay, she's... Okay. How did she get the veil? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Fully. He didn't even end up getting the, the speed increase yet the entire fight until now. She slept me as well. I couldn't take a turn before his Elva wrist is really fast. He's got a pretty fast... Oh, man. We couldn't do it. We couldn't do it. Just not enough damage and not enough decreased defense. Even with all the decreasing of the defense from Cruelty, he's just not taking damage. Damn, man. That was a... Ah, man. Errol didn't do shiitake, man. Errol did nothing. 25 million player power. What the heck, Errol? You suck, man. I need more books in Errol. Maybe we would have been able to take out that Elva, possibly. Yeah, the damage uh, is very bad on Errol without books. Stormy. What are we going to do here with Stormy? Uh, I guess it depends on what he picks, so... He's gonna go with Sun Wukong. Okay. We're gonna go... I think what we'll do is we'll do this right away. Speed and Duchess. Yes, he has Wukong, which is a clearly a damage dealer with the Lightning Cage. But I'm thinking maybe... Oh, he's gonna go with Mithrala. Okay. I'll probably just ban Torment, honestly. If he picks him. Or he has like a CV or something crazy. No, Blind Seer. She does have a revive, I'm pretty sure. Well, let's see if we just wipe him out. 
Yeah, we just wipe them out. GG's. Alright, well. You can't kill me, so. There we go. That was a quick one. 13.5 million player power. I mean, Blind Seer, there's no speed aura. I mean, she has a full revive, but personally, I put Blind Seer in like double stone skin. High speed, double stone skin. Go with as much HP and defense as possible. That's how I would personally use Blind Seer if I had her, which I don't. But I wouldn't use her anyways because there's so many other better revivers in the game. I think I'm just going to start with speed in a couple of these fights. Maybe maybe try speed a little bit more. Wukong. Duchess. Uh, I'll go with Elva. Duchess Elva. I'll go with Foley and Samson as well. Or I'll go with... Yeah, I'll go with Foley and Samson. Oh, he took my Foley. You <laughs> Dang it. Dang. All right. All right. I see you. I see you. Well, well, well. I guess I could go... I could take out his son Wukong... Foley's definitely a problem. I mean, I need to do Sammy because he'll take he'll be able to take a hit from Foley because his AoE is not crazy, crazy strong, but it's definitely strong. But I can tank it with my Samson. And then I'll bring in... I guess I could bring in another green champ, potentially, or red. Who should I bring in, though? I could do Errol again. Yeah, let's do Errol. I was thinking of bringing in Candy, but I still haven't finished his Masteries yet, so... He just doesn't hit hard enough without the Helm Smasher, I feel like. Plus, I need better gear on him in general, so... I just don't have faith in my Kandrafon specifically, although I know Kandrafon is very powerful. Mine's just not built. Ally attack, high speeds, probably. Probably gonna ban my speed. I don't think I can allow him to do the ally attacks. But at the same time, he's got a revive. Now, I do have a revive. He's definitely got stone skin on Pytheon. It looks like this is a potential CC Wukong. I'm just going to take out Foley. Because it's possibly a CC Wukong. So, we'll do this. Nice. He didn't ban my damage at all, which is huge. Does he have triple stone skin? Does he have stone skin on Uko, maybe? I mean, it's possible. No, it's all bolster, which is cool. Uh, let's try to double hit. And so we'll weaken him up a little bit and smash. There we go. GG's. Weaken him up with Errol and then smash him with Samson. All right. So he is a damage dealer. Okay, I didn't think he was, but fine. I guess he maybe he tries to throw people off. Or he's just doing polymorph on him, or not nah, temporal change because he's trying to go second or take a turn somehow. Nice. We'll take the win though. All right. So we'll move on to the next one. So yeah, Errol right now, that's how he's being used for me is he's softening up the opponent and then my Sammy's coming in and smacking him down. So we're using a little bit of Errol today. Errol is, he's decent. IPR is the one of the best clans in the game. I think it's like top five, top ten. Let's see. So, this guy's going to have ridiculous champs. I'm just going to go with speed again. Surprised nobody's used Torment against me yet with my speed. I'm going to go Duchess and Elva again as well. I did end up getting the Mythical Tome, by the way, from the Titan event. So that was pretty cool. I'll put the mythical tome into my Makage. And honestly, I might be able to fully book my Makage within the next few months, assuming that they have more path events for mythical tomes or Titan events, that is. That'll be cool. Okay, so he's going he's going the UDK Sun Wukong route, which means his Sun Wukong is crazy powerful. He's probably gonna put in another speed champ though, like a CV. I mean it's IPR, so they definitely have a Seafy or something crazy. I'm going to go with... Uh, should I go with her? He could easily bring in a Tormund. I 
could go Duchess as well. Stone skin. Uh, it's a tough one. Um, or I just ban his Sun Wukong. Yeah, I mean, all he has to do is literally ban this and put a Tormin. Let's just stick with. Let's stick with Elva. Because I, I don't want to face a Tormund, to be honest. Or if I do face a Tormund, I want to be prepared for a Tormund. Like, he would have to ban my Elva in order to use the Tormund. And then I could just, like, A1 and then just put a block debuffs right afterwards with my uh, Duchess here. So, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I mean, I feel like he's going to have some crazy champs, though. He could even have mythical champs like a Crixia or a Lazarius. He could put Makage as well if he has her. But I'm definitely picking Foley for a Sun Wukong if I keep him in. Uh, most people do not put Sun Wukong in a Stone Skin, although I have seen one person put a Sun Wukong in Stone Skin, and it threw me off a little bit. I was really surprised at that. Rodos and Marichka. Ooh. You know what? Let's try Ronda out. I might have to ban the Rodos because that's insane. I guess I could do this. But does he have a Taras? I don't know. He might have a Taras. If he has a Taras, that's crazy. So he's going to be like all damage dealers. A Warlord, okay. His Warlord could be faster than me, than my uh, Arbiter, to be honest. I got to ban Warlord. He's going to ban Foley. Yeah, that's probably just a play by him. Super high IQ play. I don't think I survive here. Okay. Well, let's see if we can do something here. Mm. If I protect, could I kill them? I don't think so, but we're going to try. She takes a turn. She's putting the strength in on. Okay. Wait, why is she taking double turns? Is she in a relentless set? This dude's in a relentless. What? Let's do this. Block actives. I probably should have did that to him though, to be honest, to Sun Wukong. So I made a huge mistake. Let's uh, go here. Didn't get lucky with the ally attack there. She has like a passive that she attacks sometimes. Counter attack. Not very strong. Oh, Jesus. She has a huge life harvest on one of them. Life harvest, five star on Marichka. That's crazy. Come on. Let's go. Why is my Ronda not doing the allies? I'm getting super unlucky. Can we strip? Nice. Um, Just do it. We didn't kill him. That sucks. He, he countered and killed me. Instant killed me. Yeah, I'm dead. Rodos is crazy. Depends on where he's going to go, but yeah, Rodos... Is gonna annihilate. Doesn't matter where he goes. He can wipe out my Duchess one hit. He's going to uh, for more HP though instead. She does still have block actives, but the A1 will still allow someone to join in on the attack, so let's see. Thank God it was only him. Phew. Uh, let's increase our speed. Uh, he has the A2 ready. I'm dead. Increase defense. Will that help us? I don't think so. I don't think so. Why is he taking so long to go? I don't understand. 
uh, we don't, we're not going to be protected from that. All right, GG's. Nice, nice roto six star. I messed up on the pick and ban though. Maybe, maybe I should have just picked uh, the rotos and banned him instead of the warlord. But it is what it is. There's not not much I could have done there to be honest. Marichka is wild. And then I probably should have just locked out the the uh, Sun Wukong and got lucky. But there's a percentage chance that I don't land the passive skills. Like I didn't land the passive block passive on the Marichka. I only landed the block active. And we're going to stick with the Arbiter though. We kind of need her or else people are going to just bulldoze us. And even if they do pitch, pick the Duchess. I mean I have champs that can take on a Duchess. It's more so, I feel like, if they have, yeah, Seafy. Seafy's the problem for me. Let's do this. He might bring in a Tormund now because they could just ban my Duchess. Let's see. In this case, I may just ban the Seafy. Unless he has a Yumeko or... Oh, come on. All right, so he's got Marichka Rodos. I can't bring in UDK because... He's got... Maybe I just ban the uh, Rodos instead. Strengthens. Samson has problems against Strengthens. I guess I could just bring in Sammy, but... We'll get Molly Wops. I might need to ban the Rodos if I bring in Samson. He's going to probably ban Foley, I would assume. But if he has a lockout, I'm kind of screwed. I mean, it's between Seafy and Rodos that I lock out here. Yeah, and he's got Mithrala because he knows that it's definitely a huge counter to Samson. He's going to just ban the Foley, but I can do ally attack with her. Maybe I can take out the Foley, or not the Foley, the Rodos right away with the ally attack. All right, so yeah, we're going to start with uh, ally attack into the Rodos. See if we can take him out potentially. No, we weren't able to. But we might be able to take him out here. We might actually win right here, to be honest. Jesus. Okay. Maybe. That sucks. <clears throat> yeah, they're going to take turns before me. She's going to A2 or Strengthen to protect. Strengthen, okay. Does his Rodos go crazy? Let's see. Mm, maybe he was softening up for the Sun Wukong. But I'm just going to take him out. Uh, we're going to do this. And let's go ahead and stun. the weekend going don't petrify thank god Ooh, we survived we survived sammy for the win come on nice counter let's go samson what? I died from the poison. <laughs> oh, I should have just AoE. I didn't realize they were going to do so much damage. No, you son of a biscuit. I messed that up. Oh my God. How did I mess that up? The poison's tick. I wasn't even thinking. I was so excited. Don't get excited, guys. Don't get excited in this game. You get too excited, you'll lose. God, God, man. Just AoE. I should have just AoE'd. Stupid. All right. It is what it is. It is what it is. I should have just AoE'd. That was the win. Damn, I messed that up. All right. Whatever. It is what it is. Anyways, guys, <laughs> don't make stupid mistakes like me. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on a video soon. Take care.